The optimum temperature for an enzyme is the temperature at which the enzyme works best. Different enzymes have different optimum temperatures. This diagram shows a temperature scale. Over on this end are colder temperatures, and over on the right are hotter temperatures. These enzymes are placed on the scale where their optimum temperature is. You can see that this is different for each one. So what's the optimum temperature for enzymes in humans? In humans, enzymes work best around body temperature. Normal body temperature for humans is about 37 degrees Celsius. This is the temperature where the largest number of successful collisions take place between the enzyme's active site and the substrate molecules. But what happens if we move away from the optimum temperature? Any movement away from the optimum temperature lowers enzyme activity. So let's look at this on a graph. We're going to plot temperature on the x-axis and enzyme activity or the rate of reaction on the y-axis. This is where 37 degrees sits on our axis. At temperatures lower than 37 degrees, you can see that there is an increasing activity of the enzyme. Remember that as temperature increases, the enzyme and substrates move around and collide more because they have more kinetic energy. This increasing activity peaks at the optimum temperature of 37 degrees. However, after the optimum temperature, there's decreasing activity because it gets too hot. It's important that you're able to relate enzyme activity to temperature like this for your exam. So why does the enzyme activity go to zero when temperature increases too high? Enzymes are denatured by high temperatures. When denatured, the shape of the active site is altered so that the enzyme can no longer bind to its substrate. On the left hand side, you can see a normal enzyme with its active site that's complementary to the substrate. However, when we expose this enzyme to high temperatures, it becomes denatured. The shape of the active site is permanently altered so that the substrate can no longer fit. The key no longer fits the lock. This is what is meant by the term denatured enzyme. This is why it's really important that your body temperature is maintained around the optimum temperature of 37 degrees C. Thanks for watching. If you want to take your GCSE revision to the next level, head over to launchpadlearning.com and check out our smart learning platform that's been designed to get you top results in your exams. We cover your whole specification and make revision fun with interactive quizzes, easy to follow videos and more. You'll be kept motivated by your own AI tutor who's here to support you every step of the way. To check it out for yourself, click here. Or click here to keep watching a selection of the videos from our full GCSE Biology course. See you there!